Megan was denied the opportunity to voice the character Tiana in the Disney Plus animated series, and Anna Noni Rose was chosen for the role. The Tiana animated series, in development for Disney Plus, has appointed Joyce Sherry as the lead writer and director. Anna Noni Rose will reprise her role as Tiana after Meghan Markle was excluded due to a feud with the Disney executives. There once was a girl named Meghan Markle with a dream and a fantasy. She imagined living in a castle, marrying a prince, and becoming a Disney princess. After a brief marriage to Trevor, which ended after just two years, she sent her wedding and engagement rings back by mail, which was seen as impolite. She then began to engage in charity work to attract a prince. During her visit to London with her former best friend, she even sat outside Buckingham Palace, secretly yearning to be Madam President. Her goal was to marry a prince and live off his wealth, allowing her to avoid working as an actress. She convinced her husband to skip a military event to attend the premiere of The Lion King, and Prince Harry requested Disney boss Bob Eager to offer her a role. Eventually, she voiced a Disney documentary called Elephants. However, she has now failed to secure a deal to voice Tiana in the new animated series. The Tiana series is considered a follow-up to the 2009 film The Princess and the Frog, where the character of Tiana was introduced. The series, originally expected to debut in 2023, is now slated for a 2024 release. It will be produced by Walt Disney Animation Studios, the same studio that created The Princess and the Frog. Nathan Curtis will produce the series, with Jennifer Lee and Stella Meagy serving as executive producers. It appears the producer had reservations about Meghan because of an alleged financial issue with Disney in 2020. Meghan caused a stir among royal watchers when it was revealed that she would provide a voiceover for the Disney documentary Elephants in exchange for a donation to the charity Elephants Without Borders. However, there have been claims that she pocketed the alleged $3 million payment herself, and the charity didn't receive the funds as originally reported. This situation has led to accusations of fraud regarding promised charitable donations for commercial projects.